What's up guys, it's Criddle here from the Anime Ball Z team with another This Is. This time on This Is, let's have a look at From the New World. Off the Tracks. So From the New World is a story about Saki, a little girl who has psychic powers. In fact, everyone that she knows and gets along with has psychic powers and it's one of those series that starts out very, very unusual and I honestly spent the first two or three episodes not knowing where the hell this series was, was going. Um, I don't want to get too much into it but essentially she is a psychic girl that goes to a psychic school in a very rural area and there's this whole apocalypse thing and I don't really want to get into it too much because this, the whole humanity apocalypse thing is the plot of the series. I don't I don't want to touch on it, but essentially she's got psychic powers, she goes to this school, and over the course of time she begins to notice that people she's known and people she's been friends with, and essentially people that have stuffed up and either pissed people off or been really crappy at school, have started to disappear. So what does that mean? There's no real way to know, there's only one way to know is to watch this series. And I can't recommend it enough, but I have to really cut myself off there because it's just one of those series where you can't, you know, really say much without ruining the plot. I will say this much, the series is actually voiced by Saki, but it's actually voiced by an older version of Saki, um, and given how much sort of goes on in this series, it'll make sense in time why she's narrating this series as opposed to, uh, narrating this series as an older person as opposed to narrating it as she is now. But essentially she's like a 13, 14 year old girl with psychic powers who's learning how to use them and becoming quite skilled with them. Um, and just how that all develops. But again, I don't want to really touch on the plot, so we're going to leave that alone. And we're going to look at those characters for this series as we look at... The Good. The Bad. And the Dubbers. So I'm going to hammer through these because um, there's not too many characters, but there's some very notable ones in here. Saki is voiced by Emily Neves, and all the characters voice their younger versions as well as their older versions and their current versions. It's basically the one voice actor will do the whole thing. And there are some variations between the voice cast of what they do for the voices. Emily Neves does a really good job of Saki because she does vary her voice among the different ages that Saki is. But Emily Neves is the voice of Jubei Yagyu from Samurai Girls, Yukie from Majikoi o Samurai Girls, and Chieri from AKB0048. Hate the name of that series. Satoru is voiced by Greg Ayers, who is Onigiri from Air Gear, Goku from Sayuki, and Karu from Oran High School Host Club. Maria is voiced by Monica Rial, who is the voice of Simka from Air Gear, Kuzuha from Aesthetica of a Rogue Hero, and Stocking from Panty and Stocking. Mamoru is voiced by Blake Shepard, who is the voice of Yakiko from the new Kyoto arc Rurouni Kenshin, Akito and Agito from Air Gear, and Magoro from Madaka Box Abnormal. Shun is voiced by Clint Bickham, who is the voice of Finland from Hetalia, Kazu from Ergia, and Kay from Madaka Box Abnormal. So without getting too much into the plot of this series and not wanting to ruin it for anyone, essentially From the New World is set in the future from now, um, where as opposed to using technology, everyone has psychic powers. Um, make of that what you will. This is a topic of contention for the series and essentially where we stand right now and where this series stands in the future, however many hundreds of years it is in the future, where that all sort of, you know, that middle block between now and then is a very, very interesting time frame and it is something that is explored in bits and pieces over the course of the series. It starts out as sort of something that's mentioned and then quelled very quickly but the characters start to suspect that something's amiss and they start to discover how they can utilize their psychic powers to essentially break through the, the lies that they've been told and the mysteries that surround them. Definitely a very, very interesting series and I cannot recommend this enough. It is absolutely fantastic and I was sitting there thinking, first couple of episodes I'm like, yeah, this is okay, I guess, but by the end of the first disc I'm sitting there going, okay, Next episode, please. Yep. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. This is... Ooh, I want to see what happens next. So definitely check out this series because it is phenomenally awesome. Hanabi have done a very good job of picking up this series because it's another one of those great series that they've managed to get a hold of. 
But definitely, if you get the chance, check out From the New World. I'm Criddle, this has been another This Is, and I'll catch you on the flip side.